All right, I'm back at this. <laughs> Time to pick up where we left off. Where we left off was, uh, you know what? Let's just not talk about it. We'll just move on <laughs> and continue what we were doing. Um, oh, I just realized the tracker is working. Hopefully that'll fix it. Uh, did it update? Yeah, let me see if I can fix an OBS. There we go. Okay. Uh, all right. If I remember correctly, the first gym is flying, which I was really hoping to use my electric Pokemon on. But seeing as now I don't have one. I'm wondering what I can actually use. Hmm. I think my best bet is just gonna be Cyndaquil, but I'm worried that he's gonna get absolutely dumpstered. Uh. Um, right, we'll head back to the town with the gym, and we'll go from there. Oh, I should probably switch out my Pokemon while I'm running around here. Just to give a training opportunity. I mean, I definitely won't be using the Caterpie at the gym. Um, an Eggleypuff? What the fuck? Okay. Okay. Not wasting your time with that. Zigzagoon. Oh, he's still asleep. That's annoying. Okay, uh... Go, Mr. Fister. This is effective, right? Yeah, nice. Okay. Why am I still at the worm at the front if he's asleep? Oh look, it's the Feebas. Alright, all he knows is Splash. This is quite good for me. I can wake the worm up. Alright, I'm just gonna fast forward this using the uh, the frame skips here. There we go. No point in sitting through fucking splash spam. Oh, an XP bag. You know what time it is? It's frame skip time. God. The defense gets so high, this just takes forever. <laughs> hey, level 7 worm. Ooh! Okay. Do I... I guess I just let this go through. Because the sooner the better, it's just gonna have a useless Pokemon for quite some time, which I'm gonna have to... Switch train, I guess? Oh, no, he still has tackle, so... I guess that's better than catching a Metapod on its own. Getting him into a Butterfree would probably be really good for me, actually. A Shinx! Oh man, speaking of electric type... Uh, 
At least I think the Shinx doesn't have any electric moves at this level. And it looks like this was aware it's got pretty good de defense against this is just one damage per How long does this have to stay in Metapod for though? Oh man, they got like no experience. Uh, yes, once again I am playing RuneScape in the background. Is this guy a trainer battle? Yeah, yeah, it's nice. Okay. By the look of his outfit, he's a bug catcher, right? Yeah. Now this guy doesn't have much power points left, but hopefully he can take out some of these guys for uh, too long. So I'm going to keep battling. I, I'm just going to fast forward this until... Because... This is just going to be a tackle spam. A Weedle. Okay. That'll kind of be... I think it's all the Pokemon, right? Nice. No, thank you. I do not want random battles. Thanks. Bye. Oh, look! Another Splash Bot. Although he's level 5, so he might know some decent moves, actually. Oh, I've only got three splashes left. No tackles left. Yeah, okay. Um, I think we just have to switch then. Uh, sure. Come out, Sparrow. Actually, isn't flying type moves good against water type? I guess not. Alright, let's go heal. I'm going to start working on the gym. I think what I'll do is I'll switch Hasselhoff to the front and lead with him. Or her, I guess. And then go from there. This, is, this building seems a lot larger on the inside. don't have any grass type, but I have bug types that I really don't want to have to use. So this is really going to be on Cyndaquil, Fister, and Hasselhoff. Uh, I don't think this building's that tall. <laughs> Based on the outside. Okay. Also, I don't remember this gym looking like this. In the original, definitely not. Level 9 Sparrow. Uh, I think it should be fine. Hopefully Sing lands. Nice. Okay, that's really good. That's free damage there. Rings keep complaining at me. Uh, I guess we'll just pound. Uh, pound again. Oh, work up. Okay. 
So I got one free turn, that's not that great. I guess I can charm. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. I don't like how much damage it's doing. Uh, you know what? I think we'll just swap. and growl, okay. Oh my god, what the fuck was that damage? I have nothing good to take this on with. This sucks. How does that go from one base damage to like a crit of like 10? Okay, hopefully this just kills. Oh nice, that's off leveled up. Oh, I am Mr. Fister. Very nice. Alright, I'm gonna go heal, because it'd be very irresponsible for me to continue. That's really is not the good sign for the gym if my moves are this weak against the flying types. <sighs> I think on the gym lane I'm just gonna have to lead with Cyndaquil and then just try and smoke screen my way to victory. Don't want to skip these because they're really good experience. Two Pidgey, okay. Charm. Accuracy lowered, okay. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Can you fuck off? <laughs> Hello? Oh my god. Oh, he can't lose accuracy? Uh... Oh my god, okay. You know what? Oops, that's the wrong button. I want to click this one. We're just gonna swap you out. Oh my god, how much does that lower the accuracy by? What the fuck? Okay. Uh, keep going. Oh my god, can you not? <sighs> Does Ember not burn? Surely Ember has burn, right? Um, Alright, we go heal now. And then, oh boy, gym leader. Not a good start. Another good sign. Um, this gym is going to be a struggle, I feel.
How many potions do I have? Nine. Okay. I'm very poor, okay. Mm. Alright, we're just gonna have to go with what we got. Alright, so well, let's see if the, uh... Run ins here. Pidgey versus Hasselhoff. What? Only one turn of sleep? Oh my god. You wanna get fucked, mate? Alright, I'm going to potion Hasselhoff. Surely this kills, right? Oh, unless I miss. Thank god. Alright. One down. I'll keep going. I don't know if Pidgeotto can hit 21. But, again, what's stopping him, right? Jeez. Okay, and there goes that plan. I want to try the sleep one more time. Because then I can switch to Cyndaquil and Smokescreen. Oh man, that's so much damage. Does Hesselhoff die if I do this? That was 12. 16, right? Come on. Okay, no, it's not happening. Accuracy is too low from the sand attacks. Holy shit, can you fuck off? Kenai, I can't even do that. Oh no. What even do I do here? I just have to ember and pray, potion spam, I guess. Okay, well, that's my question from earlier. Another potion, off you go. Gust? Oh, please don't be good. Somehow I think they did less than the fucking tackles. Roost, oh, he's cleansing. Uh, is that put him to sleep though? Nope, it does not. Gust again. Ember. Burn. Okay. Do you potion this turn? I think the gym leaders can potion, right?
Roost. All right, well then, back to full health you go, I guess. I thought Roost put you to sleep. Guess not. I mean, hopefully I've built enough lead here. I'm going to potion, and he should die to burn, right? Unless he does roost again. He dies to burn, right? Nice, okay. Ooh, sweet kiss. I think that's a good move. Um, what is sweet kiss? Let me go back. Um, I think I can use the app to check. But, right? I'll just Google it quickly. Let's see, what does it say? Causes the type to become confused. Oh, nice. It's only 75% accurate though. Um, for a flash I need for the cave. Charm's also really good. Yeah, nah. I'll forget Charm. Quick attack. Um, yeah. I will forget Lear for quick attack. I think it's going to be more useful. Zephyr badge? Nice. Rock smash, okay. Is this Gust? Gust would be really good for my Fero. Roost. Oh! I think that'd be good for my Fero as well, right? Yeah, I'll, I'll get you to have roost. Alright. First gym badge, done and dusted. I think we get our Tokabi egg now, right? I might swap Spinarak out for the Tokipi Egg and then try and get the Tokipi to a decent level. Okay, I am back to the starting route. Oh, right, I need to put the spinner rack away. Uh, yeah, I think the Butterfree is probably going to be better for me in the end. starting town.
Ooh, an experience bag. Nice. We shall pound on him. Yes. Actually, I think I might move Spiro to the front. Well, maybe I should get this guy into a Butterfree ASAP. Oh, nice experience bag. What is this? <laughs> Hit right. There we go. Done and dusted. Very right, good. Pop it. Okay. Wait, do you really only know Splash? God, imagine if I took that as my starter and that's all it had. I think I would like bricked my run from a start. Pretty sure he can take on a Pichu, right? Oh, you're eating a berry. Interesting. Paralysized. Oh, good. Oh, war off. Okay. All right, Spinarak, time to die. Nope, sorry about the sneeze there. Nope, I do not want to heal twice in a row. Okay. Oops, can't go through there. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, oops. 
I thought I had to go back. Okay. Well then, that was a waste of time. Oh well, back we go. I guess we can just use this as time to level up the uh, Mr. Was a Worm and then swap it out for Sparrow at some point. Charm. I don't think it works, right? What? Am I not the opposite gender? Doesn't have to be opposite gender. Oh my god, you're gonna spam that till I can't hit you anymore. God, what the fuck? How does a level 3 hit damage damage? It was not worth the amount of experience I got for that. Um, gonna reduce my encounter right here just by turning off sprint. City we go. Okay, is there anything I missed here in terms of catching Pokemon? I guess not. Yeah, I'm just gonna fast forward through this. Zigzagoon to punch to death. Hey, level 9 was a worm. Now what level does he become Butterfree though? Surely not much longer. That'd be really annoying if it turns out it's like you have to be level 16 to get a Butterfree. Oh my god, what? Stop spending my money! <sighs> no respect for other people's money. Alright. 
Oh, Taylor. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, it could have been bad. Because if he didn't any fly moves, uh, my metapod could have been toast. Alright, back where we started. Let's go to the Pokemon. Super potion. Okay, I guess that's useful. Okay. What the fuck is this? Me or oh my? The egg must be. I see, so it's handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Alm, then Professor Alm to you. Now I get it. Um. Okay. I'm pretty sure it's just a Tokopi. I've already seen plenty of those in the wild. Can't be that special. We will split this up here into the next episode, and then what I'll do between is I'm gonna hatch the Tokopi just in between, and then uh, pick up with the Tokopi. Alright, see you next time.